A man who sits on the board of trustees for not one but two colleges in Central Florida has been arrested in a prostitution sting by the Seminole County Sheriff's Office. That man, Harold Mills, was in court today. And as West Shoes Michelle Meredith reports, another person arrested in that very same sting was a man who works for the Sheriff's Office. Harold Mills is not only on the board of trustees for UCF, he's listed on UCF's website as the vice chair. He's also listed on the board of trustees for Rollins College. But on Thursday, he found himself on another list, one of several arrested in a prostitution sting in Seminole County. According to the report, Mills arranged to have oral sex performed on him by the undercover agent at a park. According to the report, he made these arrangements through a hookup app. He's facing two charges, including exposure of a sexual organ. In court on Friday, we learned the high-profile man is also being represented by a high-profile attorney, Mark Nijame. Mr. Green, um, there is probable cause to hold you on two misdemeanor charges. The second arrest is a man who works for the Seminole County Sheriff's Office. Leroy Green was also arrested for trying to secure oral sex. And say deputies, Green was wearing a Seminole County Sheriff's Deputy shirt that said Youth Services on the back. When deputies searched his car, the report says they found Green's gun, a Seminole County Sheriff's Office ID card. The Sheriff's Office says Leroy Green has resigned. And concerning Harold Mills, neither UCF or Rollins College say they're in a position to comment. In Seminole County, Michelle Meredith, West 2 News.